Hello guys, I am going to show you some uh, one way slots on the A side. This will help you uh, to hold long solo. Uh, this way you don't have to get your whole team out long to take long control and the turret is going to wait a lot of utility and taking it and then executing after. Um, I'm going to show you some one way smokes that is going to counter both when they execute and also before they execute so you can fight them long uh, in a one way smoke. Um, and I think I'm just going to go right into it. I have four different, some of them is more known and some of them is less known. This one is pretty known, you just crouch in this corner and then you aim like Joe. Um, I usually flash like this, so you, I can cross to the smoke, and then I jump on top of this, I just press A until I can see them. This smoke is really powerful, but um, it is also one of the uh, one-way smokes that is the most known, so make sure that people doesn't like spam it. If uh, What I usually do is just I throw the smoke, and then I throw the flash, and then I just wait behind it a few seconds before I jump up. Um, this way, uh, if they spam, you can jump up when they reload, or you can just fall back. Um, the next one-way smoke I'm going to show you is if they are already executing, doing a first and second smoke, then you can sit behind this box, crouch, line up with this line in this box, and then you look at this mark on the uh, floor, uh, aim a bit lower, and then right click. This will give you a perfect one-way smoke. For here, when you get one kill here, I usually reposition to this spot right here. You can also jump on top to get an even better one way. Um, and this is very strong because you are repositioning after getting one kill. And it's one smoke with two one way smokes, you know what I mean. Um, yeah, that is the reason why that is so strong. This will also help you. Um, uh, ruin the mono that they are uh, throwing behind uh, these boxes. I call it coffee mono. I don't know what other people are calling it, um, but it is good at countering the mono. Okay. Hmm. Um, the next smoke that I'm going to show you is called Olaf Meister smoke, and uh, the way you do this one is just you. Uh, crouch close to this box and then you uh, left click on the ground like here. I don't have a specific lineup. Uh, it's just important that it is close to this box and then you can crouch on top and then you can just walk up on this box which is a little higher which gives you a good one way. And uh, this smoke is extremely powerful because if they are executing with these smokes and you throw this one, it will make your smoke even stronger. And but the ones close cannot see you and you can spot above and you can even look half. And if they are close, you can also spot on the left side. So this one is very, very good. And then um, they will spam it a lot. When they see it, they will spam like this, but they will never hit you. Um, yes, the last one I'm going to show you is where you stand here. You look at this metal thing, this metal square thing, uh, and aim in the top left corner and just left click. This smoke is really strong because uh, I usually jump up here and then I uh, get one kill here and then I crouch down and the guy who's trying to trade him is uh, is going to fight me from a new angle in the same one way smoke. Uh, if you understand what I mean. So you stand here or you crouch here, crouch here and you aim this. And you will take first angle from here, which is the one-way smoke, and then you will drop down here, and you will have a new angle in the one-way smoke, and this will make it very difficult for the terrorists to trade. And um, yeah, <laughs> so uh, that was pretty much it, guys. Uh, I know it's a lot of one-way smokes for a very like small part of the map, but it is very important that you know different one-way smokes to hold on. Because um, you cannot use the same one-way smoke against the same in the same game multiple times, of course. Because if you use this one once, they will most likely just spam it the next time. Um, so it's important to know different one-way smokes and just like just um, go through them. You know, like throw this one one time, and then you throw all of mine the one time, and then you do this one. 
one time and then maybe you can really smoke the other one. And if one one way smoke works for you one round, you can always just throw it again and then just not use it because it would put so much pressure on the map just by having the smoke there. So if they execute with the, these two smokes, uh, here and here, and you've got one round, uh, you've got a kill with this smoke one round, you can just throw it again just to make them because they will they will play anti flash and they will spam it a lot, which is going to slow down their execute so much, which is also very strong because it's about it's about fighting while these smokes it's about like pulling them back as soon as these smokes are gone, your team is going to help you. And so the first seconds uh, of their execute is the most important. Yeah, that was pretty much it guys, thank you for watching. Uh, I will link my Twitch in the description if you want to check it out.